Welcome on over to Automotive World, everyone. I am your host, Eddie Mystery, and tonight we have a huge recall coming out of BMW. Close to a million vehicles, three quarter of a million vehicles affected. Specifically, 720,000, almost 730,000 vehicles. 720,000, 796 vehicles affected. This is over engine and engine cooling electrical systems. Now, I have up here the Z4 2012 S Drive 280i. This is going to be affecting quite a lot of vehicles. So we can see here certain 2015 X1s, certain 2012 through 2016 Z4s. We have a bunch of other 528i's. We have got certain 2016 to 2018 X5s. We have got certain 2013 to 2017 X3s. We've got a lot of things going on here. And basically what the problem with these vehicles are is an improperly sealed connector on the water pump which may be exposed to water and short circuit. Dealers will inspect these water pumps, replace the plug as necessary, and they'll install a protective shield free of charge. Now, between all the years of vehicles that we have, so we've got the 228i, we've got the 428i, we've got so many vehicles, the X1, the X3, the X4, the X5, the Z4, between all the model years that we have, we've essentially got 47 different recalls going on, and this is almost a million vehicles. Now, I will say, the latest year of affected vehicles was 2018 so luckily the vehicles that BMW is building right now are not part of this recall and they're quite far away from where this recall is but this is still a really really big recall almost three quarter of a million units recalled over a water pump connector which may short circuit causing a fire This year has been a really, really interesting year for recalls. We've covered a lot of them. Uh, this is an interesting one. I, I genuinely, genuinely don't know what to say. Um, BMW is known for having some issues. Um, this isn't the first time they've had issues with water pumps and back pumps and things like that. Um, it's good to see that the vehicles affected aren't anywhere in terms of age-wise close to the current year models. But this is a lot of vehicles. Almost a million vehicles affected. So this just kind of adds to what we've seen through the year in terms of recalls. This is definitely one of the bigger ones that we've seen. Um, I'm glad that BMW found the issue, and I'm glad, obviously, that they are going to fix this and replace, you know, these, you know, whether it's the pump or the seal, uh, free of charge. But yeah, this is just, um, this is interesting. Like I said, we, this has been a really, really interesting year for recalls. Um, this year, we have seen more recalls, honestly, than ever, um, from all different types of ranges, from things like, little things like seat belt and AC stuff you know, very minuscule things to critical things that are detrimental and can make a vehicle unsafe. And I think BMW just, you know, this just kind of adds to the list of what we've seen of really crazy recalls. And I really don't have much to say about that. I mean, I'm like I said, I'm glad they have a remedy. I'm glad that they have, you know, figured out the issue, but it's just... To see this many vehicles affected and almost a million potential units close to, it's just interesting. Let me know what you guys and girls think down below of this. I'm not really going to make too much of a hash of this because obviously you can understand the scope of this. Um, but let me know what you guys and girls think down below. That's going to do it for now. Like always, thanks for watching everyone.